Hello everyone, in this tutorial we'll learn how to shoot with a simple use of the new input system. First, let's go to the package manager to import the new input system. You need to select Unity Registry and search for Input System. Then click on the Install button. After installation, select the player and add the shooting script. First, we need to include the input system namespace to get access to certain functions and variables. Then we need a public transform point from which we shoot and we need a public game object prefab for a bullet. In the update function we check when the space key was pressed by writing if that was pressed this frame. If that is true that means that we pressed the space key on this frame. Then we need to shoot and that means to instantiate bullet prefab on shooting point position. We don't change rotation, so write just transform that rotation. In Unity, select the player and create a child game object that we use as a shooting point position. So bullets will spawn from this point. Make sure you connect that with the shooting script. Just drag and drop it in the shooting point field. Then we need to create a bullet prefab. I will use triangle sprite, change size and color. Add rigid body to D, set gravity to zero and freeze rotation on Z axis. Then we need any type of collider. I will choose polygon collider 2D. Use it as a trigger. Make a prefab. Delete one from the scene and it's important to use the prefab from the project window as a reference. Now when we press the space key we create the bullet. However, if I want to shoot to the left side and if I flip the player by changing the scale to minus one, we spawn the bullet in the wrong direction. The easy fix is to flip the player using rotation on Y axis. That's why I will add another script to the player. Usually you flip the player in the script where you control movement, but this is a simple script that will just flip the player when I press the down arrow key. So in your script just use this transform.rotate function. Next we need to add velocity to the bullet prefab. In the project window select the bullet, open the prefab view, add one script, First, we need rigid body 2D and public variable speed. In the start function, get the rigid body 2D component, then set velocity to transform that right multiplied with speed. The transform right is the red axis in your scene view and it will change side when you rotate the player. Choose the speed and we can test it. Great, we can shoot bullets. I also made an enemy prefab. It has the enemy script. The important function is this public take damage. It will decrease the health of the enemy by damage amount. Spawn particle effects and destroy the enemy. Idea is to call this function when bullets hit the enemy. In the bullet script we need the onTrigger enter 2 d function. We check if the bullet hit the enemy. Then call the take damage function that we mentioned. You can create a variable, but I just hard coded 20 damage for this bullet prefab. Then instantiate particles from the bullet and destroy it. Let's see the result. Great! This is a simple shooting concept, an idea that you can upgrade and improve into more complex shooting systems. Thank you and see you in the next tutorial.